Hey guys, what's up? So, I'm bringing you a new video. And this is another message to Brian delivers you the goods. Now, unlike the first one, um, this is more of a message of motivation and a message from a musician to another um, musician. So, Brian, I just saw his latest video and he plans on doing covers. Okay, first of all, Brian, from somebody who's trying to make it as a musician and who is a musician and knows how to play an instrument, or at least decently knows how to play an instrument, please leave the cover songs to Monica LR. If you don't know who Monica LR is, um, she does covers on her YouTube channel. She does like Red, Breaking Benjamin, and a whole bunch of different bands, Star Set as well. Brian, please leave the covers to Monica. I'm begging you, please leave the covers to her because she knows how to play a guitar. She knows the chords. She knows the chord progressions. And she knows her instrument very well. Um, I just, I, I would hate to see you butcher a great song. And also, a lot of fans of these bands, Star Set, Breaking Benjamin, Seether, you name it, or whoever you decide to cover, fans of these artists will go into the comments of your videos and tear you apart for it. I'm giving you a fair warning now, musician to musician. You will get torn apart in the comments for it. Now, I'm sure you are well aware of it. I'm not saying you aren't. But that is going to happen. That is guaranteed to happen, okay? You're no hairbangers ball, okay? You're no Godsmack. You're no Seether. You're no, you know, you're not any of these, you know, big name bands, okay? Now me, sometimes I write, you know, 12 minute, 14 minute songs, but I'm no dream theater. I don't claim to be. I'm no tool. I don't claim to be. Do I love tool? Absolutely. I saw them live and they were really, really good. Is tool one of my favorite bands? Yes. But do I try and be tool? No. You know, I try and be myself. I try and create my own sound. And I'm still trying to find my sound. You know, I don't want to sound like Alice in Chains. I don't want to sound like Godsmack. I don't want to sound like Breaking Benjamin. I, I don't want to sound like another band. I want to sound like me. And that's what you need to do as well, Brian, is find your sound. But the only way you're going to find your sound is if you play one of these. Now, it doesn't necessarily have to be a guitar. It could be drums. It could be bass. Um, it could be... Um, you can be an EDM artist and, you know, san uh, do beat sampling. Um, but... I, I really think you should leave covers alone. Um, you still have a long way to go with your original music, which also desperately needs instrumentation from an instrument. Um, and again, 
this is just coming from another um <clears throat> this is just coming from another musician and i'm just trying to guide you in the right direction man um that's all i'm really trying to do so with all that being said brian please leave you know other artists music alone work on your own music work on your lyrics you know and you know try and pick up an instrument you know it's and trust me once you learn how to play an instrument or start understanding the fundamentals of it and the basics of it you're gonna have a lot more fun and you're gonna have a lot more freedom writing songs right like i can take a simple melody like this like see how nice that sounds or I can do um, here's E minor Obviously, I'm not using a pick, I'm using my fingers, so I'm still trying to learn how to do that, but, because normally I play with a pick, but you pretty much get the picture. If you just learn a fretboard, learn the fretboard of a guitar, or learn piano or something, you are going to have a lot more enjoyment writing your songs. I promise you that, Brian. You are going to have a lot more fun, a lot more um, melodic freedom, um, a lot more freedom with melodies, if you get what, if you get what I'm trying to say, um, and create your own melodies um, through uh, your mute or with your music and um be able to sound better um it'll greatly improve your writing because sometimes you know i'll play my guitar i'll have no lyrics i'll have no idea what the song's going to be about and i'll just sit here and play something will just kind of start um, flowing through my head and ideas and stuff like that and I got a song so you can do it that way um, or you can write your lyrics first and then come up with the melody later um, I do that too I'll you know have some lyric ideas write them down in my phone and then grab my guitar later on and try and put something together. So that's what I would recommend for you, Brian. Um, I really, really hope you take my advice on this one and um, just think it over. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Rock on.